Hello guys, welcome back to Life is Strange. I'm Z. We are in episode 4 right now, part 2 I believe it is. I've uh, recently mislabeled some of them. I don't know why. I think I did mislabeled one. It's a sad ending. It was not episode 1. I'll say this now. I think it was episode 2. Oh yeah, let's get through this. Hope everything's good with you guys. Yeah, I make the episodes shorter than an hour just in case I have all that extra time. Tell a good spot to stop. So, yeah. Chloe, you're alive. Yes. Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss and now you're all over me? I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. Oh. Oh. At least she's back. <laughs> I was really sad in the last episode. I had to let her die. I could just see her like that. Now she's back and healthy. Not suffering. <sighs> I just wish her real dad was still there for her. It's just such a long wait. It's well done. Well done game though. Oh, come on, can I just play the game, please? Please. It's in five minutes of this stuff. Subs don't want to see all this waiting. 
I've seen that. Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Well, I had to press circle to get up this whole time. Okay. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not going to be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I don't think anybody would be happy after I being I can't abuse this. won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. Now drop and give me 50. I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. I'll get her out of here. Looks like David already booked a room. Wait, what's the phone number? It's all just five. Looks like David already oh, booked no. a room. Okay. I know I got a text from who though. Like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Oh, meow. At least he has one weird fan. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Okay. I'm just trying to keep this line moving. He left all his guns here. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. What am I supposed to do? I forgot. David isn't any different from me when he's looking at those family photos. I helped Joyce lose William and now David. 
Yep, locked from the other side. There's no way I can go to Chloe without going to David's locker. Okay, David's locker. Wow. Must be around here then. Oh, must be in there. Hey. Huh. I could just go out through here, I think. Okay. Locker. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Let's take a couple of wrenches. Try the puppy lock apart. It's 7171. Come on. How can I forget that? Finally, I get something right. Yes, I knew that number would be important. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Well, that is creepy stuff. Score. Back to Chloe now. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance Ooh. army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Max, now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. Yep. That's a nice truck, honestly. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yo. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. And actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate, even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. So you don't hate me for what I said to the principal? I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, <laughs> you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot for teacher. Gross! <laughs> You're out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. I wonder if she ever takes now, that, that takeoff. a great plan. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Justin. Been so long since I've seen I don't even you. remember what Nathan looks like. How am I gonna know where he is? No need to go there now. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. Makes me mad. 
climate change isn't real my ass. I hope Max isn't pissed that Warren asked me to the drive-in. Zachary. You don't have a name. You don't have a name. Hey, Daniel. Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you alright? Hola, Max. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. I'm a wannabe artist. Don't give don't up. Don't give up that easy. Just stay away from your sketchbook for a while. You need to keep taking a shot, as Mr. Jefferson says. Stay away from my sketchbook? You don't know me, Max. That's like you staying away from your camera. I think I'll just sit here bummed out, thanks. One photo, for posterity. People must have, my people must have been here. I don't think the Tobango will ever give up any secrets to us. Oh, well, that's not my bad. Well, where is Nathan? Nope, I don't want to go there. Oh, well, where do I go? Girls down or something? Principal Wells was so loaded the other night here. <laughs> what do I do? Just in case. Let me know when you found something. Well, what do I gotta look for? Oh, great. Chloe stole money from the Handicap Access Fund. Uh -huh. Oh, great. Chloe stole money from the Handicap Access Fund. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We're going to hell. Max isn't pissed that Warren asked me. Hey, Brooke, how are you? Considering what happened to Kate, I could be better. Are you okay? I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? I was distracted by Warren asking me out to the drive-in. It's a school day, so Nathan should be around. I did see him this morning heading off campus. He looked more angry than usual. I wouldn't look for him now if I were you. I have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Is it 420 yet? Uh, no, it's about 7 18 p.m., though. Oh, if I could sneak in Coast another clear. episode, hopefully. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Ah, oh, why did they have to go and do that? <sighs> I don't want our memories of that. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Oh, yeah. It's Wait that, here. That, mm, Give me the signal if Nathan yeah. or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Steal all his money. Oh, 
jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. This can only be Nathan's room. <sighs> so pretentious. Oh. Ain't noisy at all. One, 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 eh? Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. Teenage adults. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Uh. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What is with this dude? You think she's better than everybody is what? Nathan oh, Prescott. No, 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 no. All no. American teen. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh, you're sure for such a small person. Oh. Oh, yes, little phone. You are mine now. Okay, let's go. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. You are so fucking dead! Get off me, bro! I'm staying out of it. He deserves it. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Get off me! Please! You deserve it. <laughs> Maybe it's a bit excessive Please for you, too, but you kind of do deserve it. He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! <laughs> Sorry. Karma. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. Oh, he deserved it. I hate to say it, but he got it deserved it. Damn. That was intense. Warren, uh, Th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. 
I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. <laughs> or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Okay, the Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beatdown to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. Yeah. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Okay, I guess this is where I call it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, whatever. <laughs> Have a good night. Bye-bye.